What's going on guys? We are going for the Scarab Lord team in this game, aka we are going to try to find the infamous How the hell did someone find that Scarab gun? Uh, which is on the top of one of the tallest probably bridges slash buildings in Metropolis. Uh, this is in Halo 2 and I am showing you trying to not cut it just so I'm going to try to talk through the whole thing but basically to show you even if you get a clean run it, do, it still does take quite a few uh, minutes to do. What we're going to do is at the very beginning we're going to I used the tank to get down the bridge um, I killed everything but one ghost I then got out of the tank boarded the ghost and then I killed all of the banshees except for one because I found in my first few trials I found that it was kind of annoying to have three of the banshees coming in at one time and they were just constantly shooting and I am playing on easy which you can do but it is really really annoying um, what you're going to want to do is drive the ghost backwards um, if the ghost or if the banshee loses interest you're going to want to shoot near it not necessarily at it because we don't want to damage and blow it up um, by shooting enemies he actually did kind of stick with me throughout the entire thing there are a couple times you just saw him right there he does get stuck um, when the warthog when the marines and the warthog show up you want to blow them up as much of a dick move as it is but you don't really want them to shoot the banshee or get in the way um, just to make it easier on myself I cleared out the enemies um, and try to keep an eye on him try to stay around him because he can leave I think one time he ended up teleporting on me either that or I couldn't find him because he was in a stupid corner like this um, if he does get stuck you can stand about this uh, about that distance that I was just standing at and he will be like oh oh there, there he is I fucking found him and he will turn around and start flying again and then he's pretty good about going uh, across the barriers and stuff like that so basically what we're doing is baiting him down here so we can get him through the tunnel steal his banshee at the exact right moment which <laughs> I'll tell you a story about that when we get to that point um, but yeah we're just clearing out the enemies so that we can fly the banshee up to the really really tall bridge where the scarab gun is found now there is another alternate method which I will go over uh, towards the end of the video basically it's it's so it's so luck based. I actually tried it with Lane. Um, actually, I'll just say I'll just talk about it now. You have to use a box, and I think you have to put the Sputnik skull on, and then you have to put this little tiny box on the perfect thing, and then use the rocket that you find near where you board the Scarab um, to then launch yourself perfectly up in like miles into the air and land onto where the scarab gun is. We tried it for like an hour, didn't work. I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm just gonna go and do it the, the old fashioned way, the way I did it when Halo 2 came out. It was tried and true, and it worked again, even though I got killed a couple times doing this. Um, yeah, so basically, we cleared out the tunnel, the easy part, baiting him, kept him here, he gets stuck because he's an idiot. Um, what we're gonna wanna do is bait him into that tunnel, that red tunnel right there that I'm walking towards. Um, when he gets to this point, boom, he's locked in. Now what we want to do is shoot off both of his wings. Beam rifle takes it out in, I believe, two shots. SMG worked fine for me. Um, he does get through in one, but it's better to take out both of them just so you can fly through the even narrower tunnel right straight ahead, which is where we're actually going to have to do the boarding. Now, before I, like, read the guides and all that, all checked out the videos and stuff, I boarded him over where he just was, and I died do not board him prior to doing it. There's supposed to be a loading screen right around here where he is. He's supposed to be able to go into that tunnel. Uh, I thought I fucked up because I baited him and he went past the tunnel, but I actually did get him to fly back in. But then this was really awkward because I couldn't board him. And I was like, I can't shoot him because if I kill him, he'll probably blow up the banshee. I was like, what the hell do I do? Um, what you're supposed to do is board right around there, right when the loading screen shows up. One time he flew, uh, flew around this area and he just disappeared. And I was like, "Fuck! I had it. I baited him all the way down the bridge. All this shit." Um, but what you saw right there is I backed up. I did the, I did the distance thing, getting right behind him, and he started to go. And instead of turning around, he started to go. And I was like, "Fuck! I need to go over there." And I was able to board in time. Thank God. Um, but yeah, right at, once you board it and you're in that tunnel, you're pretty much smooth sailing. I don't think there's a way you could screw it up. But then we're just going to fly up to this really... Like, I don't understand. Who the hell... Like, who did this? 
who found who's like you know what I'm just gonna bait one of these uh, banshees all the way down shoot off its wings fucking fly it through the tunnel and then they will explore I mean it's genius because it probably they probably found the soccer ball they probably found the everything else um, but yeah I remember doing this in Halo 2 doing it again here and I always seem to get up here grab the scarab gun and even though I've used the scarab skull scarab gun skull I always seem to kill myself up here. It's never, it's such an evanescent moment when I get this scarab gun. But there it is, right there. You can pick it up, you can shoot, you can do whatever, and hope it helped. Good luck.